Good morning, friend. First of all, let us look at the global queues. Yesterday, the Dow Jones closed up by 524 points, and as of now, SGX Nifty is trading up by 60 points. So we can expect a gap down opening in the Nifty today. Coming to the stocks in news, the first stock is LTI Mandri. The IT company said its consolidated profit grew 11% Q on Q to rupees 1,100 crore, while revenue increased 0.8% to rupees 8,600 crore compared to the previous quarter. Operating numbers remained strong, boosting bottom line. Revenue in dollar terms increased by 1% Q on Q to rupees to dollar 1,057 million, and the same in constant currency grew 0.7%. The board recommended final dividend of rupees 40 per share for FY23. So we can expect an up move in the stock of LTI mind rate. The second stock is HDFC Bank. The country's largest private sector lending said the board of directors has approved the appointment of Keizad Barucha as deputy managing director and Bhavesh Zaveri as executive director of the bank for three years from April 19, 2023. So we can expect an up move in the stock of HDFC Bank as well. The Third stock is Godrej Consumer Products. The company has acquired FMCG business of Raymond Consumer Care. The acquisition cost is rupees 2800 crore and the deal is expected to be completed by May 10. So, in today's session, Godrej Consumer Products is also likely to make an up move. Fourth stock is IRB Infrastructure Developers. The infrastructure company has emerged as the selected bidder for the project of tolling, operation, maintenance, and transfer of Nehru Outer Ring Road in Hyderabad, Telangana. The total length of the project road is 158 km. The company has received a letter of award from Hyderabad Metropolitan Development Authority. IRB will pay upfront concession fee of Rs. 7,400 crore to HMDA for revenue linked concession period of 30 years. So, we can expect an up in the stock of IRB infrastructure as well. Thank you.